And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube who's watching this video later on for some Chandra Tribal. That's right, we're finishing out our standard 2020 action today with my personal favorite deck, Chandra Tribal. Um, this deck is just, it's a lot of fun to play. It's pretty tricky with having all these different planeswalkers and you have all the different options of like which, uh, you know, what to choose with your planeswalker. And you have the regulator also, like, so you need like your extra mana, what to copy or like to copy or not to copy, all that kind of things. Like which ability do you need to choose each turn? It's pretty tricky to play, but it's just a lot of fun to play because of that because you have so much uh, versatility. Really like this card. This is be like regulator. The two keys in the deck are regulator and Chandra Novice Pyromancer. Uh, it's not even about the plus. It's about the two minus abilities, especially that first minus ability, adding extra mana. It's what allows us to play multiple spells a turn, ramps us up into our six mana planeswalkers, gives us enough mana uh, to be able to have like regulator activations plus do other things. It's very powerful. And then plus, yeah, we get the, the minus ability that can do damage to different stuff as well. So yeah, this is our deck. It's, it's a lot of fun to play. Let's give it a try. We don't really want to see Mass Manipulation or Agent of Treachery too much, because they can steal our Planeswalkers. We don't really want that. But here we go. You like a copy of Bag of Holding in the deck? That does work, that does work quite well with Regulator. I'm not sure I, I want one really. To be honest. Um, I like all these removal spells that we have. I think they're all pretty important. Alright, got a couple flame sweepers. And good thing that we do. It looks like sweepers are going to be good against our opponent. We do not want to see you know, three toughness creatures. We want them, yeah, just keep on playing one ones. My best next turn is them playing like, you know, I, you know, two more creatures obviously would be the best, but two more small creatures, but a Legion war boss would be nice. I'll take Legion war boss this next turn or two more little creatures. I do not want to see, of course, um, Spitfire. That's what I do not want to see. All right, that's fine. All right, got the four for one. We're down at seven life. But we're still doing okay. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Playing the novice pyromancer, because then we can get regulator in play as well. If we if we draw a land, we have lethal next turn. We can attack for 20 next turn if we draw a land. We have the shot the two Chandras and the Regulator. Cause uh, we have three mana, play this Chandra, zero it, spend another mana to make four, four to double it, so you make four creatures, and then with that one extra mana, we would tick up, give them all plus two, plus zero, but then double that. So that would have been a cool do nothing on turn one, do nothing on turn two, play a sweeper on turn three. Play a Planeswalker and an Artifact on turn 4, and then swing for lethal on turn 5. Alright, I'd like to see another small creature deck. So we got Shock and Flame Sweep. So I wouldn't mind another... Small creature deck.
Hey, that's a small creature. I'd like to see that. So which one's actually better to shock? I kind of feel like it's the healer's hawk. Not sure about that. That worked out pretty well, I'd have to say. I'm happy as a hellion to start some fire. Fire spreads. So attacking for two isn't isn't important. However, I want <clears throat> loyalty on Chandra so that I can minus more. It would have been better to Find your fires <clears throat> to draw land, of course. We could have played this Chandra, minus added mana, and then triumphed. But oh well. And this is why we add loyalty. Now things are getting heated. Hmm. Again, if we would have drawn land, I would have played this and just minus two and dealt two damage that way. Well, that's not good. This is really not good. <clears throat> oh, wait, that thing turns into a four five? Oh, yeah, never mind. We're good. <laughs> Our Chandra Tribal deck is really living up to its name with this hand over here. I'm burnt out. All right, I guess we'll have to get rid of that Chandra. Play a new one. I'm a pretty great find your fires of passion within. All right, fine. Say hi to my fiery friends. We still got double minus. We got them all. Yay. Pyromancy puts a little sizzle in my skin. Oh, so we don't really need to add two mana for anything this turn. <clears throat> but next turn we can add mana to be able to play the Awakened Inferno. Should I play this thing? No, nah, we'll just play this. Stay back. I'm an explosively good pyromancer. I've got a burning desire to finish you. Can't believe Mother Ludi gave us homework. Oh no, our three Chandras all have six loyalty. No. You're not evil, Chandra. Yeah, we got. Yeah, we got. Um, We have regulators in the deck. We just hadn't drawn any. So this is not like Lava Coil. I was thinking about just like minus one, do one, exile for one, and then triumph. But it's not like Lava Coil. I mean, there's a lot of ways I can do this. Um... Huh. 
I knew you needed to sit back and watch it burn. Um. Glad I could help with your not being on fire problem. Don't worry. I brought company. Oh, I just want to hug all those fire critters. All right, we got all four Chandras in play. How they're highlighting them, I, I like my heart skipped to be. I thought they were going to Elder Spell my poor Chandras. I mean, we had backup Chandras. So it wasn't that big of a deal, but it would have gone from certain victory to almost positive victory. <laughs> Chandra Travel. Such a cool deck. Yeah, of course, Chris. Fire away. People in check. Also always happy to answer questions, and I'll answer what if I can as well. All right, hopefully we draw lands this time. Draw land. It's unfortunate. Yep. Levels are being reset at rotation. Not to brag, but I'm totally the find your fires of passion within. So that's good. Now, now Chandra's Triumph adds deals five damage, so he can kill <clears throat> a wolf if they have a wolf. Well, that's rude. I hope they have a wolf here. Like that'd be that'd be a good turn for me if they just play a wolf. Remember this one? That was not the good turn. That was That was not what I wanted. was exactly what I did not want. Now things are getting heated. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're welcome, run a train. Glad to have you here. Fire spreads. Thanks for watching. With help. Cyrus. 
Thanks for that Twitch Prime sub. Thanks for that resub. I really appreciate that. Hey, go easy. That I'm is sub number here. 18 on the day, so we're two away from a sub goal. We're almost there. I don't know why the notification didn't pop up. Unless I just missed it. So much to do, so much to see. <laughs> I'm fired up. We can do this together. Yay, they didn't play a wolf. Uh, that's fine. Okay, download the YouTube vid, the videos, and get to watch them on plane rides. Cool. Huh. Didn't pop up for yours either the other day? Yeah, I don't know. Like, it says nothing's popped up over on this side for the last couple hours. I'm just going to redo one. Just so we can celebrate. This is Zerf's over here. There we go. That's for you, Cyrus. Got to have that boat on the stream there. Uncounterable Chandra would have been the third Chandra to come on down. And Chandra Tribal 3 0. This deck's a lot of fun to play. Let's play another league. So yeah, the plan for the next sub battle day, um, usually do it the last Saturday of the month, but honestly, I think we're going to do it this Saturday. Now that I, now, now that I think about it, I guess, I guess you have the donation deck for Saturday though, but maybe we'll push, maybe we need to push that back to Sunday because, because I was looking at it and this Saturday is, is the last one before rotation because if I, Yeah, because I want to do it before Eldraine, right? Because if I... Yeah, I think it's good to do it before Eldraine. So it's probably better to do it this Saturday. Okay, cool. Thanks, Kendis. Usually, sub-battle days are the last Saturday of every month, though. That's the, the normal day. But I think we're going to bump this up a week. They didn't take the regulator. Ah, they're Grixis. So they have Bedevil. So we're either going to cycle the... The Lava Coil, the Shock, we're going to do the Lava Coil. Is this just my Grixis list that I had? Our actions determine the course wonder of if... I Asahara is just playing the, the Grixis list that I had there. Maybe he is. We should discuss our I'm ready. Let's do this. Do One day, <laughs> toast it. All right, we can we can potentially play Ugin this next turn. Time to 
remember sparks to fly. So they could have Nicol Bolas. Okay. Ionize. So not my exact list. Everything else looked like my list. But Ionize, that's different. I had two negates. Multiverse will bend to my will. I will return one day. My schemes are never ending. Hmm. So I can get rid of the Pyromancer. I can go mobilize District Pyromancer, kill the Nicol Bolas. But that's not it's not great for me you wanna go, Let's see if we hit a Chandra's triumph we hit a Chandra's triumph What's that smell? This is just gonna be bad Ugh, for you. lava coil Uh, you don't gain life. The Citadel is, is in the sideboard that they grabbed with Karn. It's not something that you just have necessarily against everybody. I am out of here. But no, you don't you don't gain life too much. I mean they could have Enter the God Eternals or something like that, but I'm going home. Consequent. friends oh they're so cute in case of one instant speed removal spell Your defiance is infuriating um yeah okay i'll uh not sure yet kendis but yeah, I'll, um, if I am doing the early stream, I'll, I'll definitely put it forth for you. Didn't they already play a land? I guess they already, I guess they had six in play. I thought they just played the sixth land and then that. I guess they played the sixth of the previous turn. Okay. No artifact removal over here, right? Nope. All right. So let's. We do want to pressure their life total with them having Citadel, of course. Risky. It's not like we don't have damage upstairs. We have shocks. We have four mana Chandra. We have not that four mana Chandra. The other four mana Chandra. We have six mana Chandra that can give them emblems. I train every day. No one is more prepared than me. We have this mobilized district. Meditate and prepare. Draw land. Land. Yes. Nailed it. Now 
Now Ashandra. Oh, right. Whoops. <laughs> uh, I forgot about that text there. No, they had the double disfigure. So I attacked the Nicol Bolas because one disfigure you know, like that we knew about wouldn't save Nicol Bolas. I will return. Witness a moat of my power. Alright. Well, we need six mana Chandra. That's what we need to draw. I really wish I wouldn't have played Ugin into the counter spell. About now. Yeah. All right, they got me. Kind of wish I waited for them to play the Citadel before playing the Ugin. The the problem is against Thought Erasure decks is obviously that card with waiting. Man, I really didn't think we were losing that, though. I really didn't think we were. But... So what Citadel can do. Sometimes they just find their second and third Nicol Bolas on top and just kill your Planeswalkers. And then uh, get to answer everything else. I think most of the time that we're, we're going to win that, but... Um, so with Citadel, just a tough card to beat. I'd very happily get paired against Grixis again, if possible. I keep in that same opponent. I'd very happily get paired in that match again. <laughs> We've been up for six and a half hours. The stream has been going for six and a half hours. Keeping this because of regulator, you know, having two Six mana planeswalkers in the opener, not ideal, but we have regulator, we have a removal spell as well. I'm not as confident in our matchup against Field of the Dead. Honestly, uh, I, I want to discard Ugin. Ugin's like the card that I'd like to cycle away. Oh, this is just Gates. Never mind. Not Field of the Dead. It's Gates. Well, that's probably worse for me. Because I can't kill a 6-6. Six, six. How do you have 6-6s six, on turn 3? How is that fair? It's just like we've played against um, Rotting Regisaur in the past. And that's the same kind of thing. They just have Rotting Regisaur on turn three. I can't deal with it. And Gatebreaker Ram, 6-6 six, six on turn three. Just, it's too big. Good hand. GG. Yay, best of one. I think I'm a decent enough pyromancer.
No, Blood Sun helps gate gate decks. Blood Sun makes their lands enter ta uh, untapped instead of tapped. Yeah, this is like the perfect opener, right? Just all gates. No more Rams. Right on schedule. Yeah. Let's try this. All right, well, he didn't attack Chandra, so we have a shot. I can either, basically I can either play Regulator or I can kill Teferi. Like, those are my two options. I think I'd rather have Regulator in play. Because this adds four mana now. Here, have some of that magic. So much for wanting to discard Ugin. Fights! With the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you so much there, Fights. I really appreciate that. Oh, that got us to our sub goal. That was sub number 20 on the day. Thanks, Don't Fights. Worry. I got this. Shepherd of the Flock? I don't, I don't think that card's playable. Okay. So obviously, first thing we're doing is just taking up that Ugin. <clears throat> There's the land. I could have used land. All right. So let's add mana. I'm getting the hang of this magic thing. Here, have some of that magic stuff. All right, so we'll minus three twice this Cavalier of Thorns to exile it. Shock the Teferi. We will meet again. Okay. Really glad they didn't kill my novice pyromancer when they had the chance. We've needed that extra mana for sure. You think it's good in a feather deck? Spending a mana to return a creature back to your owner to your hand? I think that's what Feather wants to be doing. Just one mana only on summon your own stuff. Protection for, for sweepers. I mean, you can just play a sure assemble for one more mana, give a 1 1 counter, and give your creature indestructible. Oh, come on. Why do we have to have another ram? 
Why does that have to be an 1111? Hmm. All right, so five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then this thing, 10, 11. Or I guess maybe Flame Sweep, 10, 11. I guess I don't have the mana for Flame Sweep. I need one more mana. I guess I could Flame Sweep first, grab, grab that Mobilized District. Do I want to just grab... Would I rather have a 2-2 or do I rather have the card? I'd probably rather have the card. Let's see what we get here. Secrets manifest before you. There's no problem. Fire can't solve. Hold on. I'm going to try something new. <laughs> no pressure. <laughs> okay. So there goes 111, 11 down. Stop playing 11, 11s. <laughs> I don't like dealing with those. But he's so many resources deal with that thing. Ugh, they have infinite cards, infinite mana. I don't know if I can deal with infinite cards and infinite mana. Our guys getting the pets. I mean, my... You can see how powerful these Chandras are. But I don't know if they're that powerful. Infinite cards, infinite mana. Powerful. <laughs> well, the reason why I got the three Planeswalkers is because the Novice Pyromancer Regulator combo. Those two cards are awesome. Really, I need to draw three mana Chandra. If I draw three mana Chandra, you know, I can... I can probably... Yeah, like, my opponent dies if I draw three mana Chandra here. Yeah, they're just dead. They take lethal. Three mana Chandra. Hawkeye! You did it! You did it! Hawkeye's like, what'd I do? You got me, Chandra! Good job, Hawkeye. These aren't elementals, are they? No. All right, good. Everyone knows the bigger explosions are more fun. This be gone, interloper. Not to brag, but I'm totally the Jeez. best pyromancy student. Hey, you'll get him, buddies. We can attack with a mobilized district, too. Oh, gosh, look at all these friends. We did it. I didn't think we were going to win that one, Hawkeye. But then my opponent didn't kill my novice pyromancer, and then we won. <laughs> so yeah, you may think that like really like really big creatures are definitely annoying, but our red deck can still deal with them. That Ugin was pretty clutch. And this deck's fun. That was that was such a good game. Oh no, do we have do we have the mirror match? 
Looks like we have the mirror match. I've never played the mirror match. At least I got Hawkeye. Ah. Oh, why would you put breeding pool? I wonder why they have breeding pool in their Chandra tribal deck. It'll be interesting to find out. These are some weird Chandra tribal cards. So I really need the I really need the novice pyromancer to resolve. That's all that matters. It's just novice pyromancer resolve. I mean, it's not necessarily all that matters. Counter this. Counter it. Counter it. Counter it. Darn it. Might as well give it a try. Maybe they only have creature counters. Darn. Ugh. Immediately had to have a wolf. A wolf being the only card I didn't want to see. Why don't I just activate that last turn and just discard the flame sweep? If I would have done that, we would have drawn the Chandra and I could have played Chandra and then... Uh... And then I play Chandra and then they counter Chandra. They don't get to, they don't play the wolf. Yeah. I mean... I guess this is not over. Is it? 10. It's almost over, not quite. We need to hit, we need to draw two lands. And obviously if they, if they just have another flash creature, I guess I'm dead. So they're gonna have another flash creature. So I guess I am dead. Yeah, all they need is a flash creature. I'm Chandra, the immolation sensation. I've always wanted to make a really big fireball. All right, so that that turn six, whenever we didn't hit the land drop, we drew the the flame sweep. I I made a really big costly error instead of. I just passed the turn. I needed to discard Flame Sweep immediately. We would have drawn the Fire Artisan. I would have had the mana to cast Fire Artisan. What? I just. I guess no Flash Creature. It's 
make some more room to fight in. Get out of my way. Or, you know, don't. Is it possible they just don't have another creature? I know who I am. And they don't have another no creature before they die to emblems? To is that possible at all? Oh, looks like someone's getting a little No creatures, sweaty. no creatures. Untap. Oh. Darn. All right, so we ended up four and three. I made a really bad mistake that last time. I was overconfident after playing so well the other time. Wait, we're not four and three, are we? Are we just four and... It should be four and two, right? Did I update the score wrong? Because we, we were three... We started 3-0. And then we just got eliminated from that thing, so that should have been two losses. Do y'all remember in chat that... Did we lose three? It's probably... Is that just our second loss? Oh, I updated it twice that game. Okay, at the end of that game, I changed it to 4-2. Gotcha. <clears throat> so, yeah, we lost to Grixis, and we lost to the that Flash deck. So, yeah, it did start... So, we went 1-1 one one against Flash. Um, <clears throat> if So, two things there that would have probably saved us. If they just don't have turn 4 Wolf, you know, like, they just don't have the Wolf on turn 4, I think we... We're going to stay alive long enough to be able to drop the Awakened Infernos and be able to, to be just fine. But they had Wolf on turn four. And then on my uh, turn five or six, I don't know, whatever turn that was, I needed to ditch the Flame Sweep immediately when I had the five mana. And then we would have had Chandra Fire Artisan. Darn. Oh, well. Um, so still, that was a really cool league. Uh, I think, uh, you know, we went 4-2. Uh, I think we were a little unlucky with that last loss. And, and by unlucky, I mean also, like, my wrong decision. Unlucky kind of thing. I mean, like, you know, like, the variance didn't go our way. And part of that variance was my decision. So I'm just saying, like, the variance of the game. But um, that one and then uh, the Grixis loss. I would love to play against Grixis all the time. But, you know, just Bolas' Citadel can just win games. Uh, that that just happens but anyway uh then our other you know had a, three other pretty impressive wins and then we had that really crazy game against gates that it looked like we had no shot um but we we uh snuck it out and won that one that was a really awesome game but there we go chandra travel this is my favorite deck to play still this format earlier today uh off stream i was just jamming some games with this here because yeah this is a fun deck to play i like it quite a bit um yeah i know i couldn't have known my card was fire artisan but still even if the card was like acolyte of flame or novice pyromancer or or fire Artisan, you know it could have been any any one of these three and then i would have had the mana to play it and would have tried you know kept them from not being able to just jam the wolf if they just countered them instead so i had you know, I had these uh, 11 cards, but we already drew one Novice Pyromancer, so I think, so 10. So I had, I had 10 cards that, um, you know, ditching that Flame Sweep, I could have hit any of those 10. So I that really was the play. I, I messed that up. But anyway, yep, super fun deck to play. All right, so if you're watching on YouTube, hope you enjoy this deck as well, as much as I do. Also, um, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe buttons over there. Leave some comments, all that kind of stuff. Check out all the other videos here for the um, the standard 2020. There's a playlist over there on YouTube that has all the standard 2020 videos on there. Hope you're checking out the other ones too and and perusing through them. We've play, been playing a lot of really sweet decks. Um, but uh, yeah, that's it here for the Chandra Tribal. Uh, Planar Beacon, would that be worth it here with all of these Planeswalkers? It could be. You could gain a little life. You would have to play them over the mobilized districts. I want all those mountains. I think those mountains are, are really critical. Um, we could probably cut one mountain, maybe, go to 22. But I wouldn't want to go lower than that. Because uh, not only with the mountains, 
they help you, you know, cast all your spells very easily. Even if you need like double red for Chandra plus like if you're playing Chandra and then minusing and then playing something else like a shock. So you need like red, red, red on on turn uh, for, you know, you can do it with all these mountains. But then, of course, mountains are really good because a regulator, you know, you can discard mountains or red cards to loot. So you want you want the uh, mountains that you can loot away also. So I really like having all the mountains, but um Mobilized districts have been good. I think I think they're pretty good too. I think they're better than Planar Beacon, but you could you could also talk me into Planar Beacon as well. <clears throat> All right, but there we go. So again, if you're watching on YouTube, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.